Uh, how come you haven't... Okay, you got the wool now. Are you making a warm coat? I know I'm kind of focused on this warm coat business, but I really don't want them to just hand out free warm coats to people. I needed that for trading. Uh, where, where are they? Come on. And I'm getting a little concerned about the, the death rate here. We've, we've dropped down to 50 adults, just about. I am very disappointed, actually, to see how low that's getting. Okay, he just made some. Why isn't it showing up in here? Come on. Come on, where, where are they? I'm gonna crank it down like five or even two or one or something. Warm coat. Oh dear. Yeah, sorry for that that thump. You you probably picked it up on the on the microphone. Yeah, it's a neighbors. <laughs> uh, a little bit of a thorn in my side, to be honest. Let's see here. And where are where are where where where? <laughs> Have you made any warm coats? Yeah, he's made some. It's like they immediately got scooped. Oh dear. That's not that's not what I wanted. I wanted it to appear maybe if I go back and then back again. No, it's just not going well, I guess people get warm coats then. Darn it. I didn't want that. I wanted to use that as like a trade thing. Yet they're not it's not showing up. It's it's because it like doesn't it's not getting stored or whatever. Yeah. I kind of want to follow the... How do I follow him? Um, I kind of want to follow this guy and see what he's doing. Because it looks like he's not putting it in inventory. He's just kind of making them. And immediately handing out to people. Which isn't good. It's not good. Um, well, we can crank up a little bit. Come on, put a warm coat in storage so I can... This is frustrating, actually. Our population is just dropping. This is a nasty drop. I'm surprised that it got this bad, actually. Oh, I think part of it was, you know, buildings being burned down that shouldn't have been burned down. But, hmm... Well, I think this warm coat idea backfired. I'm not seeing. I'm not seeing any. Let's see. By name. It should be down here by the wool. Warm coat there. All of them. I want all the coats that we ordered. Let's let's aim for like, nah, like 300 coats. And so now what's going to happen is, as this guy makes warm coats, the traders, which we have two of, <laughs> they'll be able to go and grab them and store them in here. So hopefully that, that will lead to... Our, our, has our food production? Okay. Now, now I'm interested in buying... Oh, it's only 20 trade value. I thought it was 30. Why did I think it was 30? Well, okay. We're not gaining anything by it then. That that stinks. Because the leather is 10 and the wool is like 7, I think. So we're actually losing in trade. Dang it. Oh no, I, I, if it's 10 and, and like 7 something, yeah, we'd gain it a little bit, but not enough for it to really pay off. Well, that's, that's darn it. Darn it? <laughs> okay, let's start buying cabbage. Delicious cabbage. So let's let's put up 200 of our that and then buy 800 cabbage. Because I think it is it's about time we start restocking everything up. So and I'm going to I'm going to trade for food and get all that food and then get seeds. And this is this is the final race, the final sprint to 
Um, 400, and I think we can make it. We're still behind on use? This is crazy. Hmm. How? <laughs> How did that happen? Well, let's, our, our drop was, woof, woof. I am not sure exactly what did that. Um, yeah, I'm not sure at all, actually. People are still starving, too. Huh. We, we need to get people back on food pretty desperately, I think. Wow, I, I, see, I expected it would be like that, and then we'd be rebounding, but something went wrong. I, I think part, okay, here's my theory at any rate. Waiting for these to like regrow and get back into deep woods, that hurt things. But on top of that, we lost, if you go all the way up here, we lost this. You know, so we're down, we, we're down a node too. But I didn't expect it to be just that bad. That's, wow. Uh, it's gonna be tough to recover from this because we have so few population. Their food production's bad. So we're just gonna, every so often, like people are gonna starve. Like this, like a little trickle. What happened to the 800 cabbage I just bought? Is it still in here? Did I actually order it? Yeah, I did. What what happened to it? Inventory, maybe? No. That should have been distributed to the population. It seems like it didn't go anywhere. Do you have any cabbage? How about you? Cabbage. Weird. The trader, it looks like the trader kept all the cabbage for himself. They're supposed to, like, drop it off here, but instead he stole it. <laughs> what a jerk. What an impossible, awful person. Yeah, he took, like, most of the cabbage we just bought and kept it for himself. Wow. Wow. Wow, that's... Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm annoyed by that. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, food production is probably still low. Um, okay, we, we need to fix this situation before it gets even worse. I'm closing the mine. I'm closing... Uh, well, we got one stone cutter, but I'm closing that, too. I'm tempted to honestly take a teacher out, so at least 13 students. Yeah, we only need one teacher anyway, so... Which school... Oh, uh, they kind of split it up. Well, I'm closing one of the schools. So we'll get a few extra labors that way. Okay, so now that we have these uh, only six labors, what I'm going to do is um, devote them to gathering. Like all of them. Because gathering is going to get more food than any other option. And we absolutely need to stop this downward spiral. Yeah, because basically we've dipped so low in population... I'm going to have to, like, kind of go and watch this again, figure out exactly what went wrong. I, I, I'm assuming it was kind of that one-two punch of, oh, we've lost all this forest that was giving us stuff to gather, as well as um, the fire burning down a node. But that was... That was really brutal. Like, that was almost a town... We almost, like, lost a whole town there. And, I mean, we're still behind on food. Honestly, I'm going to trade more firewood. Um, and I know that's kind of hurting our stores of firewood, but I think at the same time, it's, it's just necessary. Uh, let's get some more cabbage. Because if we don't shore up our food stores uh, and fast, um, that's that's a potential town killer. That's like potential extinction. Wow, we dropped down to 40 adults. I I can't believe it. That's like I 
Douche. Well, so much for the theory that this is a step function. <laughs> um, it's yeah, we had some kind of negative feedback that caused that to drop so quickly. I should have been watching that closer. Um, and if I had been thinking about it, I would have said, well, you know what? It's so bad. Let's take people out of the mines. Let's take people out of the quarries. Let's do anything we can to keep us in some kind of food. How's our production? Still way behind. Why? Why are you so far behind? Um, I'm taking people off woodcutting, even. Putting them towards... Let's try to get more fishing. Because if we don't get ahead of it, even with a little bit of stores we just bought, I mean, we're toast. That we're, we're dead. And we're just not doing it. Um, okay, I, I need to look at this and say what jobs are unnecessary. Um, okay, traders, we're not going to do anymore. Uh, we need the firewood for people anyway. Uh... The vendors help with food distribution, so I'm gonna keep them in. We need a little bit of wood cutting. Um, we don't have any plagues. I'm turning off the physician. And let's put them into fishing. I, I feel like fishing has more potential for making um, for making food. I'm also, honestly, I'm kind of tempted to turn off all the schools, but no, I want. I want the population coming in to be well educated so they can kind of make up for this fiasco. How is food production? It's still right making no food. Why are we making no food? Okay, it's climbing up now. Okay. Phew! So as long as I know we're making more food than we're losing. Ah, uh, when we're not. Um, this is like kind of an emergency. I, I'm feeling like I need to close all the schools. Normally, I would discourage that, but I need I need more labor. I need a labor pool to start gathering again. Otherwise, I mean, we're we're just not going to survive this. We're almost in a death spiral. And people are freezing too. Oh man. Because that's another thing that can happen. Like, if we run out of firewood, people will freeze to death. I hate to close the schools. That really hurts us in the long run. Um, okay, it looks like the curve is slowing down. But slowing down, we're really low. Still some starvation. It just says has died. Not even why. It's just <laughs> people are bored here and they they just perish. It's it's a cursed land. Um, oh my gosh. I, I well. I th I think we can pull out of this maybe. <laughs> um, What's her food production like? Still so low. What is going on? I'm so flabbergasted by this. I just don't, I don't understand it. We have six kids and 50 adults and they're all on food. They should be making weight, like they should be making a ton of food right now and they just aren't. It's like a random bad harvest or something? Hmm. Okay, now now we're catching up. Uh, still, some some houses are still hungry. Ay ay ay. Well, that was scary. That that wasn't good. Um, that that nearly killed us. Like, I mean, wow, we're we're back to fifty people. <laughs> Ouch. Um. Well, I mean, we can climb out of it eventually, I hope. Uh, we have so many structures built for gathering and, and wood cutting and all that, that as people come in, we're going to like have them fill, fill up the spots. But man, man, oh man, I, 
it's crazy, you know, and, and like I said, I, I've been playing like Banish a long time. It's to be fair, like I would have had farmland long, long ago. Except for the fact we're trying to get this achievement. So, hey, some achievements are tough. Some achievements just aren't going to become all that easy. I'm half tempted to close this a little bit. It doesn't give us enough. And, like, the people, they could go and work at more useful ones that have, like, a wider area. Because, like, if we look at, let's look at the production, say, of this gather. He's making, like, um, well, let's just look at the onions. Um, like 124 onions versus, if you look at this one, probably gonna be like 300 something. Oh, I guess it's, it's, now he's making the same amount as this one. Um, I'm surprised. I, I actually thought he wouldn't be making that much. Yeah. He's making a little more than those two. But that could be, it could be a situation like, oh, this one just doesn't have a full complement of gathers mm -hmm. in it. So, I don't know. I, I'm not going to judge it immediately, but I still think, like, so much of it is taken up by this mountain range that I think that might, might be compromising the output of this one. We'll see, though. We'll double check it. And if it is, like, I have plans for this. We, we could do, like, a quarry in here. Um, and there's some errors for mining as well, so, you know, we'll kind of take this whole concept and put it down here. Let's try to run at a faster speed. I think our food production has, yeah, we're, we're starting to get ahead on that again. Now, um, honestly, I think we need, let's see, cut out the tailor for now and get another woodcutter because... Man, we're, we're going to need firewood badly. And last thing I want is for us to end up freezing to death next winter. And it's already early autumn, so. Yeah, that, oosh. We also need to get the schools going again. What, who's this? Oh, a hospital. Yeah, I, I closed everything. It's just nuts. I feel bad because that was like a, a lot of potentially educated workers that we just, you know, lost. Mm, we're gonna have to wait a while for this to rebound so much so that I'm thinking it, it might be worth me yeah I'm gonna cut the video here and yeah we'll, we'll get back to it um like I'll wait and see if we get some labor I mean not some labor some uh some nomads coming in or something of that nature so I'll, I'll get back to you after we've kind of regrown a bit and gonna head on things so, I'll see you guys in a few.